Good morning, you guys. It is Friday. We are about to jump into a really fun, exciting weekend. And yes, I do have a top on. I just have my little bandeau top because I'm about to film my part two of a video I have to do for a brand. I'm actually working with this brand, so it's super excited. I will show you the self-tanner that I used because it came out so nice. Yeah, I just wanted to come on here really fast to start the vlog because this is gonna be a fun, filled weekend. But all right, let's get into doing this TikTok because I have to send it in today so they can approve it because I have to still post the part one. So I have my little phone set up here. I'm just gonna set you guys right here because this is normally where I always put you in the little corner so you can see what's going on. This is the self tanner that I reviewed last night. It's from Pita Jane Beauty. They're like kind of a newer-ish company. They're kind of like a smaller brand, but they reached out to me and they wanted me to do a video. So I said yes, duh, because that's like what I do on TikTok is self tan. So this is the dark color. I tested out the medium last night and it did give me a very pretty medium color. I, I love how it turned out. I like the color. I have to post my part two right now and just do that really fast and then i'm gonna get ready for work today i'm gonna do a couple tiktoks while i get ready for work and yeah and then i'm gonna get dressed and go to work until four to do my makeup I just finished my review video and look at this top I got it from Amazon it's literally so cute and like comfortable it ties in the back and it was so cheap and green is my color too all right I'm gonna film a couple TikToks so what I normally do is I will write down all of my videos that I have ideas for and put them in my notes so today I'm gonna be doing I started vlogging that was the first thing um, I was supposed to do a lighting setup video like how I set up my lighting, but it's really not that much, but my desk is a mess and I don't want to post it on TikTok, so we're gonna have to wait till the desk is clean. So I have three more that I have to do. I'm gonna do a get ready with me, no talking, because Jake's gonna do my voiceover. He told me he would, so we're gonna do that. And then I'm gonna do a grande mascara video, and then I'm gonna do a rare beauty blush video. I wanna do like a mixing of the blushes to see if I can get like a pretty color. Um, and I think that will be good. So we're gonna do that, see how it turns out. All right, you guys, it is 8.40 in the morning and I started my videos at like maybe 6.40. So we are done. I'm about to get dressed for work. I have nothing planned today. It's Friday, cause last Friday I got my nails done. Um, but tonight I think I'm gonna start trying on stuff to wear because we're going dress shopping tomorrow And I bought a couple outfits from Zara that I want to try on so we'll do that later when I get home I really hope the tops that I got fit me because they're so cute But they are white and I don't want to try them on with makeup on because I'm going to ruin them But yes, I will be back later and we will do that little try on haul. I am home from work Finally, I have to decide what I'm gonna wear tomorrow because This is like a big thing like you need to look good when you're wedding dress shopping because like why not? So I have a couple things in mind Look who it is on my bed <gasps> Who's that? So oh, beautiful <laughs> My room has like nowhere for me to like prop my camera up and just film except for like my little windowsill and my desk. So we're sitting in front of the windowsill right now because we're gonna go through some clothes because I need to find something to wear. So I got a couple things from Zara. I got two tops, but the only thing is with me, I like to wear my makeup and my makeup gets on everything. So if I wear a white top, it's gonna get on the top when I have to like take it on and off. So I don't know if we're gonna be going with that, but I'm gonna show you guys what I got. So this is the first one. It's like so cute. It has like a little tail on it and it's like just like a bandeau thing. It's really cute. But the only thing is too, 
this is how you put it on so there's like a little zipper there so I have to like shimmy my body into it and then when I take it off I have to pull it over my head so I really don't know if this is gonna work the next one I got I think is cuter I got this one it's like it goes like ties around my neck and then it literally goes all the way down like the side it's so cute and I've never worn anything like it before but again it has the same like slit on the side like zipper this one might be a little bit easier for me though to get like in and out of but I just don't want to risk this top getting like dirty we're literally going for tea at the plaza after and I am not going to walk in there with my white shirt covered in makeup I'm gonna go get the third option that I have and it's not as like what's the word like elegant but it might be a little bit better for trying on purposes so this is the third option I think I might go with this one just because I like it a lot more this top is literally everything the last time I wore it was for New Year's Eve but it's so pretty so it has a little beading to it and it's just clear and mesh with like sparkles and I feel like that's very like bridal but obviously I'm not gonna wear this like obviously I need to wear something under it so I have a couple white tops that I can like kind of pair with it so I'm gonna try and figure out which one looks the best tomorrow I'm gonna try them on and we'll see how they look and I'm gonna bring a tote bag of shoes I want to look cute going there, but I don't want to hurt my feet at the same time because this is New York and there's a lot of walking. In the tote... Huh? Yeah. Your camera has. Just put, them, just put them on my bed. Ugh, interruptions. Okay, I don't even know what I was saying. Shoes. I'm going to bring three pairs of shoes, which is probably stupid, but I don't care. I'm also bringing these to wear when I try on dresses so I can see what they look like with like a heel on. These are really cute. They're also from Amazon. They're not that high. They're only like 3.5 inches, maybe 3 inches. They have little rhinestones on them. They're pointed toe and they're super cute. They're just slide on heels. So yeah, that's just my little update that I have. Doing anything crazy tonight. I'm just hanging out at home. And but yeah, I will come back in the morning because we're going to do a little get ready with me for TikTok, which I'm super excited for. And then I might do a little get dressed with me on TikTok and decide what outfit I'm going to wear. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, I lied about seeing you in the morning. I do want to attempt to do some heatless curls. I haven't done them in a while, so we're going to pull the little rod out. So here she is. She goes on your head like this and then you have to like wrap your hair around it. The last time I did this, they turned out really good, so I'm kind of excited to see how they look. I just hope they don't turn out bad this time because we have a very important date tomorrow. Heatless curls, you kind of want your hair to be a little bit damp, so they kind of just stay curled all day. I use the Dyson and I use this part and I'm just going to roll it back. There's my little roller and I put it through the roller. Now we just tie it up. It should look like that. And I will see you in the morning. Get ready with me to go wedding dress shopping at Kleinfeld's. Get ready with me to go wedding dress shopping at Kleinfeld's. I am definitely not putting the glow on my body today. No makeup is going on my body. Don't mind my hair. I put my little curling rod in last night and I'm really hoping that it turns out decent. So if you're not familiar of what Kleinfeld's is, it is a really, really big bridal wedding store. New York City, I should say wedding dress store. This specific place was on TLC, Say Yes to the Dress, and that literally was my favorite show when I was little. I'd watch it all the time, and I would watch all the brides get their dresses, so now it's my turn. I am going today with my mom and my sister. We're driving to New York, and then my grandma lives there, so we're gonna go pick her up. Only about a two hour drive, so it's not that bad. I am very excited, but I am super nervous. This is my first time going dress shopping, so I just don't know what to expect, especially going somewhere like that. I am gonna be vlogging this whole experience. So I have my camera right here, so everything's gonna be filmed. For the makeup today, I'm gonna keep it kind of like bridal-y. 
So for my blushes, I'm going to go in with the Rare Beauty. This is in the shade Nearly Apricot. It's so pretty. And then I'm going to mix it with my Pinkasm. So my appointment today is at 11.15. It's like 6.30 in the morning right now. I got up super early because I wanted to get ready before we leave. And the appointment's only like, I think, an hour and a half, which is not a lot of time when you're trying on dresses. So as far as dresses go, I know like what I want, but I'm open to like trying different things. But I am the type that if I like something, I like it and you're not going to change my mind. I want to do two dresses. I want to do one for the reception and for the ceremony. And he already knows what I like and what I want, but, but he does not know what they're going to look like, so... Why? Do I look orange? For my blush, I'm going to go in with this Patrick Ta one. It's more of like a corally shade. I did this one yesterday and I kind of really liked it over my pinkier ones. For bronzer, I'm using my Gucci one, of course. I'm going to do a little bit of baking because I want this to last all day. I'm putting a little bit of Dior lip oil on. For the brows, obviously, going in with the Grande Laminate. In the middle of my makeup right now, I'm going to set it, and then at the end, I'm going to set it again. For my eyes, I want to use my Tarte palette. This one is so pretty. Look how, look how pretty these colors are. So after we're done dress shopping, we are going to the plaza for tea. I feel like an old woman when I say that, like, like an old rich woman or something. So if you're not familiar with the plaza, it's basically a older bougie hotel, and they do tea time in the courtyard. If you guys have ever heard or seen the movie Eloise, that is where they filmed that movie. I'm like debating if I should do a half lash because my eyelashes are so long, it's kind of hard for me to put the lashes on, so we'll see. I'm gonna put a little bit of bottom mascara on. I have not worn lashes in like months. Okay, I don't think I'm liking this, so we're taking this off. We're sticking with natural today. Lips I'm just gonna line with Pillow Talk. I'm gonna go over this a little bit with Charlotte Tilbury, Kim KW. Okay, no can serious. you not crunch your bag? I'm gonna set one more time with the One Size and the Charlotte Tilbury. Okay, can you stop crunching for like one second? All right, I'm gonna take this hair out. Hopefully it looks good and I will be right back. Okay, my hair is looking crazy. I'm probably gonna have to like swoosh it to the side or something like that. It's fine, it'll drop throughout the day. All right, the hair is just like wild today, but here's my outfit. I have this little white corset top on. This little sheer top is from Windsor. It's so cute, I've been waiting to wear this, so it's like the perfect day. And then I do have my jeans on, and then I'm gonna wear these little sparkly sandals to walk around. I'm also gonna bring a pair of heels so I can wear them when I try on my dresses. But here's the final look. Wish me luck and I will see you later. Good morning, you guys. My makeup is done. I'm about to take this hair out. I'm really hoping that it looks good because I'm really gonna be annoyed if it doesn't i just filmed my get ready with me on tiktok so that will be inserted in this video i'm gonna take this out first it's looking promising hopefully i didn't get it too wet oh yeah let's spray it really fast all right, the moment of truth, this little roller. All right, I'm gonna just comb it out a little bit because it's like crazy. This is kind of how I want my hair for the wedding, like side and then like all curly. So maybe I'll keep it like this today. All right, let's pick out my outfit. I decided I'm gonna go with the bedazzle top because it's gonna be the easiest thing to get on and off. So I'm gonna put that on and we'll see. Do you wanna be on my vlog? Hi, say hi to my vlog. No, hi vlog. <laughs> Here's what we're working with. I put the top on, I wore this one. It's like a corsety white top. So I feel like it looks fine, but everyone's gonna know I'm the bride today. Do you want to say hi to my vlog? Say hi. Hi. 
To whom am I saying hi? Uh, my followers. <laughs> oh, oh, you followers. <laughs> yeah. And then mommy can say hi too. Hi. <laughs> On the way. So the first Spider-Man movie was filmed on this building. I can't even see it. Look at that. That is crazy. Come in. Let's all look at the $2,600 bag in Bergdorf's. It's actually really cute. I don't want to touch it because the sensor might come off. Look at that. That's crazy. Looking for my second dress. Maybe it'll be this one. Just kidding. Ew. That's pretty. That looks heavy. It is heavy. It was my ratchet nails. Put your hand, put your hand in it. You have to hold it like that? I think you hold it like... Oh yeah, clutch. That's pretty. It looks good. You hold, that's how I can That's how you hold it. That's that looks nice. Look, I like this one. I like this. Stick, stick the fingers out. The day, Irene, no. I would totally wear this to work on a Tuesday. I would totally wear this to work on a Tuesday <laughs> with a pair of loafers. Yeah, her loafers. We are at the plaza. We're gonna have lunch and tea. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Right there, right here. No, I'm trying to get nobody. All right, you guys, my camera died when we were leaving New York. I just wanted to come on here and end the vlog. I had such a fun weekend. It was very successful because I did find my dress. So that is like half the weight lifted off my shoulders because now I have to find the second one. I will definitely be vlogging that, but I hope you guys enjoy this video and make sure to stay tuned for next weekend's vlog. I started to get on like a routine with vlogging because I actually really enjoy it. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Next weekend is not going to be as fun, but we're going to find things to do. But thank you for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!